hello. It is Thursday. It's two minutes past eight, and it's time for Zoom Down. And on our show tonight, we have our three-time champion shooting for Tetra Champion. It's Paul Nixon. Hello. And standing in his way is uh, no mean feat if he wants to get past her tonight. It's Hazel Drury. Hi. And then, of course, we had a Mr. Question Mark, but we can reveal one of those question marks. It's the young Ronan Higginson. And we have Stephen doing the lexicography for you tonight, and we have Mouse doing the stream. So welcome to Zoom Down. Welcome, welcome, welcome. So, not too bad, Mouse. A little panic there, but two minutes, that's all right. People give, will, they'll give us two minutes. Hopefully they haven't switched over to whatever's, whatever else is on on a Thursday. No, you sure. can't watch Bake Off anymore. No. That's finished. That's finished. Well, that was a Tuesday, I think, was it? Or was that Tuesday and Thursday? No? I have no idea. No idea. But, so, Stephen, are you looking forward to these ones tonight? Yeah, we're, well, we were starting to run out of people to throw a poll. <laughs> so, <laughs> we thought, well, if he wants to be a tech champ, he's got to earn it. He has. Mm -hmm. And he's got a hard task tonight, then, hasn't he? Yeah, definitely. So, Paul, three time champ. How are you feeling about this one? Yeah, you certainly certainly thrown a hard one at me uh, tonight. I was actually um, on the the same show as Hazel back in series one, I think, but didn't get to play her because I, I lost the first game of that show. I think we so. wanted I think we, yeah, I think we, if I remember, I think we'd wanted you to play, but then who, who beat you? Then Philip Aston. Uh, right, okay. Hazel, and, then then Hazel, and then Hazel beat Philip, wasn't that the one? Yeah. And saw Hazel um, demolish Philip somewhat. So I, I know how good Hazel, Hazel is. So it's, yeah. Yeah, good, good game in store tonight. Well, this is it. If you want to be a Tantra champion, this is the challenge. So anyway, have a good game tonight. Hope Thank you me. play well. You have been playing well, so hope keep it up. And we will come to your opponent tonight. Hazel Drury, welcome back to Zoom Down. Thanks for having me. How are you doing? Long time no see. Yeah, good. Um, I've got my annual leave at the minute, so I've had a couple of days off. It's a good time, right, because you're a hard-working woman, so you've got a, bit, got a bit of leisure time now then. So have you been uh, putting yeah. in any practice? I haven't been on actress that much. I was recently. thinking that, yeah. I'm I'm ATP. Was, yeah. Paul will be glad to hear that. He was like, excellent. She hasn't been practicing hard. That's good. <laughs> when I looked her up, she's ranked third in the pro ranks. I, well, it doesn't mean she's not really, 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 really <laughs> good, Paul. Yeah, that's, that's what I'm saying. Yeah, so. so, Hazel, have you played Paul before? I, I don't think I have. No? Okay. Uh, I don't think so. Good. I've that's not been good. on for a while. Right, well, as I said to Paul, uh, Hazel, I hope you have a good game. We'll chat to you in a little while. And we'll come to our third player tonight, Ronan Higginson. Welcome back to Zoom Down. Hello. How are you doing? I'm doing okay. Good, good, good. So, yeah, you were you were one of the question marks tonight, but as you are guaranteed to play in the next game, where win or win or lose for for Paul and or Hazel, you will be playing. So we'll have if um, if Paul beats Hazel, we have another player to play. Okay. If Hazel, if Hazel wins, uh, you will play Hazel. So that's how it will okay. work. And we will come to you for a bit of a chat, I suppose, in whatever during this game. So sounds good. Excellent. Yeah. All right. So, uh, Stephen, how are the chat looking tonight? Right. Um, the chat are looking good. We've also got the return of the Adam Latchford's bank account memorial charity sweepstake. <laughs> um, Adam, got, Adam got paid or something, did he? <laughs> They must, they must well, be throwing too much money at him that he has to give some charge. Well, it's, re it's, it's reset back to 10 quid. It's 10 quid, right? That's, that's So um, it's you pick two numbers between 101 and 999. Mm -hmm. If any of today's numbered targets match one of your picks, Adam will donate £10 to a charity of your choice. Okay. I've already got my guesses in. All right, I'll go low. I'll go low and I'll go high. I'll go 117. And I'll go nine seven two. Paul. Oh, let's go three 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 and six six seven. Six six seven. Okay, nice. Hazel. Uh, one two eight and six seven nine. Nine, I was four. muted when I said mine. In case you can't lip read, they were eight six nine and six two three. And finally, Ronan. 
Oh, uh, I think I'll have seven, three, eight, and two, six, seven. It's gone. It's gone. I think of something random. Okay. Oh, sorry. Guessing the jars, guessing the sweeties in the jar, isn't it really? It's one of yeah. those you're like, yeah, just give it a guess. That's it. Oh, and we've also got uh, Martin Peckham in chat saying, if it goes tonight, then he's going to match the £10. Good man, Martin. Very good. Excellent. This is good. That's just because everyone was saying he hated charity, isn't it? It's Martin. just to try and prove that he's not, he's not a charity hater. He loves a bit of charity. And, of course, it wouldn't be the start of an episode without the stats of the day. Mm -hmm. So this stat concerns the max score available in the game. Mm. So both games yesterday had a max of 121. So I want to see, um, is it more likely for the max of a game to end in, say, a one than any other number? It turns out it does. So more games have had a max score ending in a one, so 41 games have done that, than have a max score ending in six, seven, and eight combined. They've combined for 34. And as an extra treat, I've prepared a graph. <laughs> It's like being back at work, Paul, isn't it? Mm -hmm. It's got to be just a poor, low sample size. Graph. Next slide, please. We are speaking to a statistician uh, there here, Stephen, as well. Just not, not convinced by that analogy. <laughs> <laughs> we'll see. If the max ends in a one now, I'll, I'll, I'll believe. You leave your hat. Yeah, that's it. I believe it's likely to start in a one. Yeah, well, if the sample size is 230 games. Yeah, you'd, and, you'd think and the high score more, is 230 but... as well. There you go. We did 23. So it's, you're talking it's 111, 121, 131, 131. Yeah, 111, 121, 131. So you'd expect 23 games each, which is, uh, well, number of games ending in a zero should be, yeah, it's 22 games have ended in zero. That's the only one that's near to the average. That's weird, yeah. Hmm. Now, well, when you think about it, this is going to delay the game a bit. Bear with us. <laughs> if you think about it, um, if you get all eights available in the game, so all letters rounds have an eight available, mm -hmm. then the max score is going to end in a zero. So in order for it to end in, say, an eight or a nine, either pretty much everything has to be an eight, or you have to drop a lot of points. So it only works if all the numbers games are solvable, then. Um, I mean, they usually are. Suppose they are, yeah. They would be kind of most most times, wouldn't they? Yeah. You'd think so at least you, three out of four games are solvable, maybe more. Yeah. Yeah, I just thought it was interesting that there was a huge disparity between that one through five was so much more common than six, seven, eight, and nine. Yeah, uh, I feel like it should be near random. That's very weird. No, I get what you're saying, but because yeah, I mean, it's going to be in the sort of the high one twenties if there's if there are no nines. Usually, no. That is, would they not be the most common like, averages if there are no nines? One twenty five, one twenty six, something like that. No, it's more like um, mid to low one twenties. You think, right? Okay. Because a nine won't a nine being available rather than eight won't change the last digit. Mm, it just adds ten, doesn't it? Yeah. Mm. All right. Well, we'll suck it and see, and suppose see what we see. What we can maybe some more data needed. Paul, bigger sample size, as you said. But watch both maxes tonight. Be one thirty six. Okay. There we go. I'm sure we'll, I can. We'll be, be running a book on this now as well, Stephen. Be careful, like all these gamblers that we seem to have attracted in the chat now. They're just like, yeah, I'll bet you that tomorrow's wet or something. Right. Well, we'll crack on then. It's twelve minutes past. So, if everyone's ready, we'll make a start. I'm sure you could work this out for, like, the the TV series or Raptorus or whatever and get some idea, but yeah. Yeah, yeah, you have a bigger sample size, I suppose, so yeah. Right, cool. so Paul, Paul and Hazel, if you're both ready? Yeah, okay. Good Best luck. of luck to the pair of you. Hope you both play very well. Paul, it is your prerogative. Take it away your letters, please. Okay, thank you. Uh, let's have three vowels and three consonants. Okay, yeah. they are I, A, and E. L R D. Oh, it was just three, wasn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, let's have another one. And another R. And another. G. And another. 
See a pattern here already in a final C. There's the look. Just went when you showed your, you were sort of shaking your paper and it showed then it, the camera changed to mouse shake and it was weird. It's kind of like a weird oh. <laughs> visual effect. Your page turned into mouse there for a second. So yeah, Lard, you're here, Stephen, as well. Uh, yeah, you couldn't go beyond seven. There were quite a few in there. There's Ace Girl, Carried, Girdler, Glacier, Graysile, Lardia, Radicel, and Radical. Ace Girl. Ace girl, I think that is an eight. Is uh, ah, okay, it's from Bermudan English. It's a close female friend, Bermudan English, okay, yeah, or Bermudian because my Mrs. Paul she goes to Bermuda quite right well, probably once a year over to the over to head office and all that. It's a weird, they're kind of a bit weird, the old Bermudans, they kind of got that American sort of the Hamptons kind of vibe or something, mm. but then they wear all preppy kind of clothes with the short trousers, like blue blazers and pink shorts with brogue, with brogue shoes and grey socks. It's a, it's a, it's a look, like. But an ace girl. Mm. Okay, let's run that one past Viv. So, okay, seven points apiece, and it's round two. Hazel, your letters, please. Uh, please, can I have CV7? You can. It's N, E, and T, E, N, I, and M. Another consonant is an L and another vowel, please. Final, final I, thirty seconds. Well. Yours, please, Hazel. Timeline. Timeline. Paul. Timeline. All sci-fi fans here, Stephen. Yep. Uh, Say, so, yeah. Chat's mainly gone with timeline. There were other eights available. I'm not surprised you went with timeline because the others are ilmenite, liniment, melinite, and menilite. Liniment with an E or li with an I? Uh, with two eyes. L-I-N-I-M-E-N-T. All uh, right, because it's normally with an A, isn't it? Liniment. Is it the same thing or is it something different? Uh, let's just check. So a liniment is an embrocation for rubbing on the body to relieve pain, especially one made with oil. Okay. I always thought that was with an A. Can it be with an A? Can it be with an A? Um, it... Does not look yeah. like you can be. You can have L I N E A. -E -E -E. Lineament. Or lineament. Oh. Yeah. yeah, that's a different thing. That's different, is it? Maybe that's when I'm confusing the two then. Okay. All right. All right. Very good. 15 all. Uh, round three is Paul, your numbers. Uh, let's go six small. Six. Here we go. And they are nine, eight, and ten. Five, four, and seven. Your target, 760, 30 seconds.
760. Yeah, 760. And Hazel? Yeah, 760. Your way, please, Paul. Nine times eight. Nine times eight. Plus four. Plus four. 76. Times 10. Times the 10. Hazel? Yeah, same way. The line of best fit, that one. Yep, um, that's the most intuitive way of doing it. Uh, looks like that's... Oh, Adam Dexter when um, 10 plus 9 is 19 times 8 times 5. Oh, 19 times 40. Right? I was looking for it. Yeah, I was looking for another 19 apart from the 10. Oh, well. Right, is goes. everything okay with the stream? I'm not sure. Um, it looks like it was struggling a bit earlier, but everyone seems to have seen the numbers around at least okay hang on just let us know guys if there's any problems just let us know as soon as you can yeah my my laptop screen is being sorry i keep like tilting my camera my laptop yeah. screen is really flashy today for some reason okay. and i'm right sorry oh good okay round four then is hazel your dexters please Okay, CV7, please. CV7. They are S E D E L E D. Um, another vowel. U. And another consonant, please. And a final, final D. Please, Hazel. Deluded. Paul. I'll go for deludes. <laughs> deludes. One of the, it was, yeah, they were kind of staring you in the face, really, weren't they, these ones? Yeah. yeah. Stephen, yeah. was there anything non obvious like that? Um, well, if you had anything longer than seven, you are deluded because right. there were no eights. Mm -hmm. uh, the other seven was sledded. Sledded. Hmm. And just as a note for the stream, it looks like the picture's freezing. Oh, it's very jerky, but the sound is okay. So, you know, while we wait, uh, let's go for football focus time. Mm -hmm. uh, Women's World Cup qualifier, I told um, people in the call about this earlier. Uh, Belgium Armenia was 11 0 at half time. Uh, it's now 12 0. Mm. But Belgium have only scored once in the last 18 minutes. Yeah, looks like we're getting freezing and occasional buffering. Yeah, but there was a couple of good ones in between there, Mouse, as well. It was good for a while. Any clues as to why? Yeah, Adam Latchford says, I love on BBC Football when you look at the scores, it often specifies some are women's teams and not the others. That's where your 11 nils come from. That's in the name, Adam, isn't it? It'll say like Sunderland ladies. It's, they've all yeah. got different names, haven't they? Sometimes they call yeah, them. Yeah, I think some of them's like, um, yeah, here we go. I'll be back. It will take about. Uh, 30 seconds. So just let us know, guys, straight away if you can. If how if there's if you notice any changes, if it's better, the same, or worse, just let us know, please, in the comments. That'd be good. Okay, cool. Right, will we crack on then? So round five is uh, Paul, your letters, please. 
Okay, three vowels, three consonants, please. Okay, they are A, A, O, T, D, and N. And a consonant? R. And a consonant? Z. Um, and a consonant. <laughs> and the final R. Seven. Seven, Hazel. Um, dodgy seven. Okay, yours please, Paul. Adorant. Adorant. Hazel? Um, I'm pretty sure it's spelt wrong, but narrator. I think it's three R's. Um, so you spell, how are you spelling it? N-A-R-A-T-O-R. -R. I'm pretty sure it's not in. Yeah, I know narrator usually has a double R. Hmm. Yeah, it's double R, unfortunately. So, Adorant? Adorant is in. Very good, Paul. Well played. In fact, the only seven. It is a worshipper or devotee, especially as represented in art or iconography. I knew he'd seen something when he kept picking all those consonants. So, Well done. So, so seven points in it, and it's round six, which is Hazel. You first go with the numbers. Uh, one large, please. One large, okay. Your five smalls are seven, nine, and three. Another three, eight, and your large is 100. And your target, 370, 30 seconds. Seven two, Paul. Three six nine. Three six nine one away. Okay, we'll go for that then. Uh, three times a hundred. Yeah. Nine times eight is seventy two. Yeah. Add that on and take away the other three. And take away the other three for three six nine. One away. Was it possible, Stephen? Um, well, let's just see. Um, oh, I see it. It's I freezing see it. again and lagging a bit again. I see it now, I think. I see it now, yeah. You see the solution, or you see the... Yeah, I see the solution. Uh, yeah. it, was it. it ends in plus 100. Yeah, that's the most intuitive one. Ah, uh, yes, of course. Isn't it? Once you see that, you're going, oh, yeah, it's easy. Yeah, so you do 7 plus 3 is 10 times three, times nine is 270, then add the 100. First time I've ever come up with one, not even needed the pen. It was like, yeah, it just ends at 100, there you go. So, Mouse, what's the story with the stream? What are they saying? Stephen, what are they saying? Yeah, it looks like it's uh, still laggy. They might want to... Maybe Maybe try restarting the stream. Without stopping it. Yeah. Is that yeah. an OBS thing then? So anyway, that was seven points to Paul, wasn't it? Yep. Um, there is an LNAFP in there. Is there? Go on. Uh, so you do 3 plus 3 is 6, mm -hmm. uh, times 7 times 9 is 3, 7, 8, oh. and you take off the 8. Very good. 
Pretty nice. Well done. Mm. Well done, indeed. So, uh, do we have a solution for this, or do we... So is it pretty unwatchable at the minute? It's no, there's no point having a chat right there, really. If you guys like... Yeah, I mean, Graham's in chat. This would be a great podcast. Um... <laughs> yeah. What do we think? We just get Graham in then? Because there's no point. There's no point trying to work out a solution live on air. Really. Yeah, if you sure. Yeah. Let's try one more thing. Oh, for fuck's sake, come on. Yeah, Belgium Armenia is still 12 now. Still disappointing. Taking their foot off the gas. Okay, yeah, well, I mean, if Graham wants to take over, I'll let him because I don't know what the fuck's mm -hmm. going on here. Graham, whenever you, if you're good, you could join. He probably won't be able to hear us if the streams. Oh, yeah. oh, I thought you said he was in the Zoom. I talk to so many people that. Someone I think I talked to two days ago ends up way down my list. Yeah, I'm trying to. Is, was he in the Was he in the chat? Yeah, he's in the chat. He's in the chat. All right, okay. Okay. I want to say we're back. You think something changed there? Are we back? Um, but it's a bloody good question. Well, I'm sure they'll tell us if we're back. Yeah, well, yeah. In... Stevie G is winning. Hey, if... Are you saying you don't come to zoom down for the pictures of Paul's forehead? <laughs> I know that's why I watch zoom down. Well, that Paul, right, okay. We've got two of them tonight. Uh... -huh. uh... What it was frozen on on your on your your mug was it Paul then yeah I I've think had that it was quite a few times Paul. make it a mm, yeah it's... if we can if we can get Graham, Graham knows yeah he knows he's, he's coming he's coming fantastic. So we're back. I hope so. Everyone, hopefully you can hear us and see us in full 720p and all that. Not stunning 4K or whatever, but we're not we're not that good yet. Wouldn't like to see any of us in 4K to be honest. Now. But we will come to Ronan. So Ronan, have you been playing along? How are you doing in this game? Doing okay? Yeah, I'm doing okay at the moment. Cool, 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 cool. Yeah. yeah sorry about all these tech technical technical things. Yeah. So you were telling me you were telling me in the prelim there that. Well, you're going to be 16 soon, aren't you? So you're going to... I am, yes. When is that? Tell us all about it. That's in January at the moment. So, so sorry, in two months at the moment. So not long now. Doesn't feel and, like that. And you're going to get your application in straight away then? Uh, or, hope okay. to, yeah. Okay, so Series 85 is all about... Young Ronan, that's it. Well, I mean, it was, mm -hmm. I was just sort of saying to you on the, on, on the pre-stream there, there was... Um, 
without spoilers, but this Stuart's opponent today was a was a young sixteen year old. So maybe it's a it's getting more popular maybe among the youth again as well because it's not you don't really get that many, do you? I mean, it's been over sixteen for how many years now? But you don't see too many sixteen year olds. You get a few seventeen year olds, but not sixteen year olds. Do you remember any? It was around 2012 or 13 when they changed it. Hmm. But you don't really... I feel like it was a bit earlier than that, but around that time. I don't really remember anyone of late, so... Owen, Owen Monaghan was 2010 and he was 14 at the time. He was 14. So I think that was the last one. I mean, that's probably because there's now a, quite a large turnaround time between auditioning and actually going on the show. Yeah. So there might be 16 years who apply. But they'll turn 17 by the time they actually film. Uh, maybe actually, yeah. Yeah, I'm fairly sure I was, I was 17 when, when I applied, I was... but it was 17 when I filmed. Yeah, I was 17 when I was first on back in the day. But in those days, you had 10-year-olds going on as well. I'm glad I didn't come up against one of them. Well, we had one on for Series 1 final, Paul, if you remember that, Alan Saldana. So he was, mm. but yeah, must have been. Yeah, the... he won the series when he was about 10 or something. Yeah, but you, just, you must have been sorry for his adult opponents. You know, that's, I mean... One thing losing to maybe a sixteen or seventeen year old, but losing to a, losing to a ten year old, <laughs> like, yeah, having to break it to break it to the, the people back home, your aunties and stuff. Well, yeah, I lost a loss to a child. So, yeah. so Ronan, yeah, you look looking forward to it then. I am. What well, what are you most looking forward to about it? Well, not Anne, um, definitely. Not Anne. Um, okay. No. Okay, we have to be careful there now. People think we're we're wearing wearing this ground thin. Oh yeah. Apparently, we're not allowed to talk about countdown on a countdown derived game show. I don't know why. No, not. But you're not a fan. No, then, no. I think the other host as well. Not really, but it would be good to just play it for real, see how I do. Well, Rachel and Susie are oh, lovely. Well, no, it has to be said. No, anyone anyone who's on tells you they are. They're really lovely. So. Um, they are. Stuart, Stuart was singing uh, Rachel's praises there today. She is. She just makes. She she really takes an interest in you, Rachel. I think she's the the one that sort of looks out for you and makes yeah. you. You know, she gives you a smile. And it's like you get a smile from Rachel. You're like yes. So it makes you feel good. You know, it makes you feel good yeah. inside. So. Um. But yeah, eighty five. So do we know anyone? Do we know any other big guns going for series eighty five? Stephen, you might know this. Um. I. Don't really pay much attention to who's auditioning. Ronan, do you know anyone? Do you know anyone you might might run into from the actress world? Uh, well, I don't. It's probably bound to be a few people from actress. They're keeping their head down, probably. They're not advertising it really. That seems to be the way of. The way of things, doesn't it? But they'll probably all know when you're going on, so they'll be like, "How do I avoid this young Higginson chap?" And I don't want to run into yeah. him. <laughs> but yeah, no, it's a great experience. It is. And hopefully, hopefully, you 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 get on soon. So make, make sure and get get your application in nice and sharp, and then chase it up as well. Just make sure that they've received it and all that. There's no harm, no harm with a little phone call just to make sure that they <clears throat> everything is in order. Because I think some, <clears throat> excuse me, I think some people apply. They get it gets lost and they never hear back and I just wouldn't be the type to let that lie. I'd be like, what happened? I'd have to chase it up and see where it got to. And did I waste my postage or did I put enough postage on? And that's what they say. A lot of people just put a, like a second class stamp and it doesn't get there. So, well, it's all by email these days, isn't it? Hey, well, not all, not all. You see, they have to have they sort of have to keep both both options on the table. I think so. Maybe sort of for older people who maybe not have any have an email, so. And I just preferred it that way as well, just to get the documents and fill them out because it's all handwritten stuff, isn't it? What you know, what your interests are and all that. So, yeah. I mean, I don't know. Do they even read it? They don't seem to really care what you what you write as long as you can play the game. But... Yeah, exactly. Unlike so, most well, other game shows where you've got to show some personality. I think they do, but I think they look. I, I think. I mean, I think that's part of the audition process. I think you have to be able to show that you can talk a little bit. I think that's. Uh, you know, there's no point being brilliant if you're not literally not going to say a word. You know? sure, you Maybe they good. check your spelling. Maybe. So it would be easier on the electronic version to do that, then, wouldn't it? Yeah. So, Ronan, what else are you into apart from countdown? What else? Do you, what else do you do when you're not playing countdown? Any other well, hobbies? Much other than school, just all the hard, just a big year now at the moment. So, yeah. Are you into I'm your sports at all? Not too much, to be honest. 
multi pin again. Sorry, Graham. Sorry. Okay. I always think it's good to have another hobby, especially because yeah. you. I mean, we, all us guys were quite obsessed with this one hobby. So I think when you when you are uber obsessed with something, it's good to have a you know to do something. I'll else. get bored after a while, probably. If, you know, I've got on the show because there won't be much to play for anymore if I do get on. I haven't seen you as much on Apto. You, like you were pretty much an ever present through the start of lockdown and stuff like that. But yeah. I haven't seen you on as much, so taking no. a bit more break. Um, yes, just trying to got some other stuff uh, to focus on at the moment. Just schoolwork and stuff. Yeah, stuff like mm. that. So mm. haven't had the. Um, well, it's probably much good time to play. As much it's probably as good college. for you. You don't want to. You don't want to be. Too, you don't want to be on there all the time as well. No, just... it's good. You just. You need a rest. You need. And as I say, it's. I. I. Like I say, I have my music. I always think it's good. Always good to have another interest, even if it's not as big a hobby. But so, something else that you can just go right. I've done too much of this. Let's go and do some of that. Yeah, I like my music. Do you like your music? What are you into? Yeah. Well, no. Um. Well, it's just. Uh, I did do um a couple of instruments back in the past, but I haven't done for quite a while now. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Jazz. Sorry? What did you play? Guitar? I, I, no, I did file in at one point. That was about two years ago. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So you know your music theory then? You're a trained musician? No, not really. I haven't done... Um, I haven't picked it for um, options in that school anymore because uh, it does get hard, apparently, as it goes on. So just yeah. sort of yeah, stick to the easy ones. Yeah, it does get all the, the sight reading and all that sort of stuff. I, I never just never went down that path. Holy yeah. amateur musician, me. So, but anything, anything that just takes your mind off something that we're all pretty obsessed about, and we can all we can all get too much of at times. We can all play too much apto, and sort of does your head in at times, doesn't it? You need to walk away, and do something else, you know. But anyway, good to talk to you, right? We will, we will crack. We will crack on with the game. Um. What are we? 4632. It's round seven. That's Mr. Nixon, your letters, please. Okay. Thanks. Pull it. So three goes, three consonants. Sure. E, E, U, M, S, and Q. And a consonant. N. And a consonant. F. And a consonant. And the final R. 30 seconds. Just a six. Six, Hazel. Hazel, and we lost Hazel. Oh, she's gone. Has she gone? I checked the video nice. during the round, and uh, oh, she's she? back. She's back. Oh, sorry, it, it crashed. Hi. Oh, when did it crash? Did you get the 30 seconds or not? I, I didn't get the 30 seconds, but I saw all the letters, and then it crashed. But I have a six. If that well, that's okay. Yeah, what your six is? Uh, Queens. Queens, okay. Paul? Yeah, I've got the same word. Queens as well. Queens. All right, that's good. No harm done, anyway. It was one. It was a flat round, anyway, Hazel. There you go. Paul had flattened it there with a the big steamroller and all those consonants at the end. Stephen? You say that, but Ray's got a seven. Oh, has he now? Go on. Uh, he saw Freenums. What are they now? Is that like Freenum? Uh, yeah, it is Freenum. It's the alternate spelling. So oh, nothing for Frenulum. Oh. Oh, three nums. Okay, right. So without just the one E, but then the S. Okay, right. Yeah. Uh, the other seven available was Surfmen. Surfmen. Is that common enough, Surfmen? My word. Just surfers. Nothing. It's nothing figurative or anything. That's just surfers. Surfmen. Um, yeah. Let's see. Yeah, a member of the crew of a surfboat, a lifeboatman. Ah, uh, okay, right. All right, okay, well done if you got one of those. It's round eight, and that is Hazel. Your letters, please. Uh, CV7, please. Sure. T, 
O S O C E and G. Um a consonant S and the final vowel please. And the final final E thirty seconds. So, Hazel. I think I've got a seven. Seven, four? Plus to six. Which is? Scoots. Scoots. And Hazel? A do is, I, I didn't have the letters screen up, so I'm not sure if all of the letters are there, but Stooges. Stooges yeah. is there. How come you didn't have the letters up? I'm not... Um, because when when I got disconnected, when I went oh. back to the chat thing, I haven't got the link. Ah, okay. Have you not, have right. you not got the page? Do, have you not got the page? Did the browser not stay no. open? No. Okay, I'll, I'll, sorry, um, I'll, I'll give you I'll give you the link again, Hazel. Okay. Oh, thank you. Yeah. So in the meantime, Stooges is fine. Mm -hmm. Ah, thank you. So there was one other seven available. Octoses. So um, octos or octos is a monosaccharide having eight carbon atoms in the molecule, especially when these are all in an unbranched chain. You like your chemistry, Stephen, don't Let's you? Pretend we know what these words mean. Mm -hmm. You probably do. I don't. I don't. Right. So Hazel, that catches you up a bit. Back within seven, and it's round nine. That's Paul. Your numbers, please. Uh, six more again. Six more. Okay. They are seven, six, and nine. Two, one, and seven. And your target is 473. 30 seconds. Four seven three. Yeah, four seven three. And Hazel. Uh, four seventy, not written down. Okay, so Paul, four seven three to you then. Uh, seven plus two. Yeah. Times nine. Mm -hmm. Is eighty one. Take away one. Eighty. Times six. Four eighty. And then knock off the other seven. Knock off the seven. That's the way I did it. Stephen. Yeah. Um. Looks like the other way that's done in chat is uh, 43 times 11. So 7 times 7 minus 6 for 43, then 9 plus 2 is 11. Or 7 times 6 plus 1 for the 43. Yeah, lots of ways to get the 43. Yep. 43 times 11, well played, very elegant indeed. Okay. Okay, Paul. All right, so what are we now? We're round 10. And, uh, Hazel, your letters, please. Uh, CV7, please. Okay, they are B, I, L, O, M, A, and R. Um, another consonant. Is an R. And a final vowel, please. And the final I, 30 seconds.
So, Hazel. Six. Okay, Paul. Uh, I've only got five. Which is? Um, broil. Broil, yes. Hazel? Baylor with an O. Baylor with an O, Stephen? Yep, Baylor with an O is absolutely fine. Well played, Hazel, well played. <laughs> Same thing, Baylor. Yep, there were two other sixes. Mm -hmm. There was Barrio and Morale. Um, Morale, M-O-R-R-A-L. What's it mean? So I'll bring that up. Uh, chiefly in Spanish-speaking or Spanish-influenced areas of the Western United States, a horse's nose bag. <laughs> moral, moral. Okay. All right. Okay, very good. 62 to... Sorry, Stephen. Uh, no, go ahead. No, I thought someone was speaking there. Um, 62.51, it's round 11, and that is... Paul, your letters, please. Okay, three vowels, three consonants. Okay, they are... U, O, and O, T, N, S. And a consonant. N. Uh, vowel. A, it's not like it. And another vowel. And another vowel. And the final A. Best of luck. please Paul sonata sonata and the same sonata sonata suntan yeah sonata suntan uh you couldn't go beyond six the others were nantos santon and sonant and sonant as in the opposite of assonant or just the opposite of dissonant yeah yeah so it just means of a sound or letter Sound. Okay. There we could do. Uh, Eleven points. It remains the gap. It's now round twelve, and that is Hazel. Your letters, please. Uh, CV seven, please. Okay. T I G I M O and G. Um. Consonant. K. Um. Final vowel. Final A. Best of luck. Paul? Six as well. Yours, please, Hazel. Maggots. Maggots. Yeah. Paul, I'm sure I could. Yeah, I knew you were going to hold it up, I would say. There's a lot Stephen of maggots. Quite a few maggots in the chat, Stephen, I'm thinking. Uh, yeah. Mm -hmm. There were a couple of other sixes, but I'm not going to blame you for not getting them. Mm -hmm. uh, Magtic and Makoti. Makoti. That's one of those... Yeah, one of those nasty sixes that you can never remember. It's Ma Matoki and Makoti and all those hard to remember which is in and which is not. Um, so if you're wondering about Maktik, it's South African. Uh, it's an explanation of astonishment, delight, or etc. Maktik. Okay, so it's... Okay. From Afrikaans, yeah, it sounds... Yeah. It? Okie doke, 11 points it remains. It's round 13. That is Paul Nixon, final letters. Okay, three vowels, three constants. Okay, let's hope they're decent this time. Here we are. U, I, and O. H, T, and W. Uh, constant. 
S. And a consonant. M. And a consonant. And the final, final T, 30 seconds. Seven, Hazel. Seven. Yours, please, Paul. Townish. Townish. Something that's like a town. Okay, Hazel. Out hits. Out hits. Yep, townish and out hits are both absolutely fine. Out wits here. Yeah, out wits. Uh, the max was seven. So you could have had nuttish, out hits, out with. Outwit, townish, untwist, and without. Without. Okie doke, right, we're, it's 11 points, and it's round 14, which is final numbers, Hazel. Got to win this one. Uh, three large, please. Three large, okay, here we go. Three smalls are two, six, and seven. Your larges are 75, 100, and the 25, and your target, two, nine, seven, 30 seconds. Hazel 297. Yeah, 297. Paul 297. Uh, 297. So, Hazel, take it away. Uh, 6 divided by 2 is 3, three. Yeah. times 100, and then 75 divided by 25 to take away. Not the hard one you were looking for, Hazel, I'm afraid. Yeah, nice and easy. 297. Paul? Um, 7 minus 6. 7 minus 6. There's it's 1. 100 minus 1. 99. And times 75 over 25. Oh, 75 over 25. You'd use that one. There you go. 297. And that gets you across the line, Paul, in a very attritional game there now. Really, it was a tough, a tough slog, that one, wasn't it? Yeah, so, a bit up and down. But... Hard luck, Hazel. Hard luck. But you'll be looking Thank to get you. you'll be looking to get the conundrum now. So Okay. So if we're both ready. We have your fingers on the buzzers. Yeah, you have your you have your buzzers there. For both ready. Um, as... Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Do you know? yeah. Yeah. So the very best of luck to the pair of you as we reveal today's zoom down conundrum. Hazel. Hand right. Hand right, she said. Earthwind, I said earlier on. <laughs> Hand right is correct. Well played. That was very very quick. Were you anywhere close to that, Paul? I, yeah, I, I got it just too late for Hazel. She was too, too quick for me there. She was very quick on that one. So Scraped through again. You're a oh, master. Boy. You are the master of scraping through these games. It's like it's, it's been getting tighter and tighter every time. <laughs> Two points last time. <laughs> so, hard yeah, luck, hard luck, Hazel. These uh, heavy consonant selections, like they're they're not pretty, Paul. I have to say, no, they're not they're not pretty to look at. <laughs> like the, the Jose Mourinho style parking. They are, well, I was thinking more Greece two thousand and four, really, yeah. like you know. Yeah. <laughs> but they won that tournament. They did. Absolutely. So, yeah, I'm more of a more of a Jurgen Klopp man. Throw everything at the throw everything up the one end at the same time. That's, <laughs> that's more my style. Win or lose, I, I hate ones away, one away and two away and stuff like that. If I don't get it, I don't get it. Yeah. So, so very well played, Paul. Well done Thank indeed. You. What's he? What has he finished on, Stephen? Um, he has finished on four hundred and one. Four hundred one. That rings a bell. Which else. just puts him into second. So one point ahead of Rachel. Oh, Rachel was four hundred, right? Okay, yeah. All right, Paul. So you're number two seed. Oh. Excellent. Okay.
So very well played. Well, well played indeed. Thank you. And thanks for, for having me back again. It's, You're very welcome. You're very yeah, welcome. An absolute pleasure to be back. And Hazel, commiserations. It was a, it was a difficult game, that wasn't it? It was a... I, tr- I just can't do numbers <laughs> under it was, pressure. It was quite attritional. It was quite attritional. So we have our other player just looking to see. Okay. He'll be joining now in a minute or two. Okay. Yeah. So remember that stat earlier? Yes. That said the max of a, when I said the max of a game very rarely ended in a six, seven, or eight. Mm-hmm. The, the max of this game was 118. There we go. That which is very low, isn't it? That's a, yeah. That's a that's a low mark. The, yeah, I did see the last uh, four letters games contained no e. We had a lot. They were all in the there first. Was, uh, I checked. There was yeah. a run of sixteen. They all came out together. Sixteen cards mm-hmm. in the vowel pack with with no e. Uh, the, 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 there was. Can you the, check your messages, Graham? Can you check? Can your I check my messages? Oh, okay. Some dodgy shuffling with the letters going on. <laughs> oh, so. Yeah, for people who were following the Belgium Armenia game, it finished nineteen nil oh, Belgium. Hold on, hold on, hang on a minute. Hold on. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just talking to my Facebook Messenger. Ignore me. Yes. yes. <laughs> Private conversations. Go on, with Stephen. We might have to wait a few minutes just for our player yeah. to be coming. So, hang on. Yeah. Our new player sent me a, a message saying, "Send me the thing." But what thing? Oh, he knows. I was telling him he knows, but it's just. Does he not have the Zoom link? Is that? No, he has that. It's the other bit. Is he on the call? He's coming now. Oh, okay. Also, so also no yet. one's won the sweepstake yet. I suspect we may be waiting a while. Well, it took it took quite a while. He says his computer is updating as he turned on. Oh, God. Okay, no. let's look at some more stats from uh, Paul's Tetra run. The total Tetramax was 480, which is... Got to be pretty low, isn't it? Uh, Rachel's Tetramax was 477. Which was very low, which I remember thinking at the time we thought that was really, really low, yeah. That's about the same percentage, isn't it? Mm. I've got one point more from the... Yeah. Just seeing if there are any other Tetra runs that have gotten lower. Uh, No. That's the second lowest ever Tetramax. I've only got myself to blame for those dodgy uh, picks. That's what you get for picking six consonants. Nothing good ever comes of it. Well, maybe. I mean, I suppose if you want to um, fish for like Hutzpah or something. I apologize to everyone watching the stream who all think they've received a Facebook message. Hmm. So our player two will be on in a minute. It's just picking some. Oh wait, Armas just called me out. Don't hate on three vowels. <laughs> oh no, but we've lost our player one. I like three. Oh, um, did you update the number on the board to say which episode it was? Someone mentioned. No, in, no, someone right. mentioned in chat that they they they're very yeah, observant right. in chat. They, uh... they are. Yeah, it's twenty-four. So you're right. You get away with nothing. So yeah, we lost Ronan. So we don't have player one and we don't have player two, but other than that, we're ready to go. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. So they they will be joining forthwith now. They're just Ronan's computer died. And there were updates to do on player two. But as I was saying, when I was on the show, this this happened. We had a two hour break halfway through a, a game, six rounds into a game, and we had to Go away and have dinner, and that's a good yeah, place to start. Paul, well, actually, yeah, that's where. Yeah, it was it about that time of day. It was about that's, that's the place to start. Five or six o'clock. It was quite yeah. quite well well timed, but quite quite disruptive. Kind of halfway through the game, I remember when we came back finally after two hours, that we'd all kind of got into our seats, literally about to start filming, and then someone shouted at Nick that he would he changed his suit as if he was doing another show and the continuity. Oh, continuity Got to go and put your other suit on, and that held us up by another ten minutes, which he was mortified by the fact that we'd been waiting for two hours to get back on, and then held us up even more. We'd kind of forgotten that we were mid-game. 
Hello, Ronan. Hello. Back now. We've lost that link. Mystery question mark. May have Zoom issues. Oh, well, then he's come to the right place. As <laughs> indeed. Uh, right now. So while we wait, let's see if there are any other trends coming. Yeah. Let's see. Um, we haven't had a nine available in the last four games. Not pointing any fingers. <laughs> There's lots of three val nines out there. Yeah. It just didn't uh, come. We haven't had an invalid word in the last three games. Yeah. You still have one. Um, narrator with oh. the wrong number of hours. Right, that's because I didn't put it in. Uh, yeah, ignore that. So if we ignore the invalid word, there haven't been any invalid words. Oh, drum roll, drum roll. Dun, 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 dun. Where is he? No picture. But... No picture yet. That's not good, considering his camera's on. It says camera off, does it? Oh, oh yeah, just, sharing... go, just share your screen. That'll be fine. <laughs> what? You're sharing, you're sharing screen, Eddie. Turn it off. What? You're sharing screen. <laughs> Is that being streamed to everyone? <laughs> you're sharing your screen. And... <laughs> Stop the share. Hold on. Can I override it? No, I can't. Eddie, can you hear us? This is fun, isn't it? He's just said yes, but in a direct message to me. Okay. Tell him he needs to stop the screen sharing. Why is this camera thing muted out? I've never seen that before. Uh, it means he hasn't got his camera, or his camera's not working. Uh, his camera's being used for something else. All the cap, all the camera's being used for something else. Um, but yeah, in the in the uh, for for those who are, cannot turn on their camera, in the in the uh, Zoom. Uh, status bar at the bottom there is a camera icon marked stop and start video you press the upward pointing arrow you can select which camera you want to use it it may have selected a camera you don't have in preference to a camera you do have it likes doing that it's very hard to tell these tell people these things when they're not on the call isn't it yeah much easier when they are can he hear us can he hear can he hear me He's gone. Yes, he can. Maybe. He can hear us. Okay, he can hear us. Go on, go on, go on, but anyway. I can hear you. You, he says. Um, but he's dropped off the call again. Oh. Tell him to choose the correct camera if you're chatting to him there, because he doesn't see, hasn't seen any of my messages. No, I mean, I don't think he, I don't think he can hear us now because he's no longer in the call. Um, or maybe it's because I'm just not. No, he's not in the call. He's I mean, not in the call. Text him there. I'm just to make sure he has the correct camera. Do, 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 do. He's connecting. Same story. Have you got the right camera selected, Eddie? Go to the very bottom left down with the camera icon and make sure that you can see if there's another option of camera. Uh, Dan, 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 I, I, I don't know what. Oh, Dan Tamesis Spinks. Sorry, I, I couldn't read. I couldn't read that name. Dan Tamesis Spinks says, uh, "Hopefully, Adam Dexter will just randomly appear halfway through round seven.
some of them in the chat have not worked out who the mystery question mark is because they only have a uh, they can only see a first name and not a surname, and there are multiple options. <laughs> I don't know what to say. I don't know what to say to him because what's he do? That's going to remain a mystery. Like then what? He's saying choose the camera. Then what? Well, if you just choose the correct camera, then it it should work. Can he hear us? Well, he he could before he left the call and joined again. We can hear us. He says, "Yeah, well." I, have you got another device? We, yeah, have you got? We can't. Just, just, just come on on your phone, Eddie. Come on, you, yeah. Join on your phone. Join on your phone and use your your laptop for the for the letters selection. So join Zoom on your on your phone. So close that other one and join join the join it on your phone. Make sure you have the other one closed, or you'll get feedback. He's gone again. Yeah, I told him to. He's, he's leaving on that one. He's going to join on his phone. Uh, meanwhile, Martin's giving us updates on another Women's World Cup qualifier. Uh, Spain, Faroe Islands. Uh, Spain recently got, have just scored three goals in two minutes and are now 8 0 up. Spain, Faroe yeah. Islands. Yeah. Only one of that. Only one of those teams have a tan. I would say. He's Hello. On. And you're muted. Just unmute yourself. Yeah, Yo. and then we're good. How are you doing? Good, right? So, bottom of the so at the bottom of the link at the bottom your chat dialogue at the bottom of the screen or whatever you are or maybe Graham just send it to him in Messenger. Okay. Send him that um, link. So open that other link up on your computer. Okay. Uh, yeah, I've got that straight away. Well, I've Web sent you a link in every form of I'm communication ready, known go. to man. Please open that and have it alongside the Zoom yeah, call. Yeah, I've got that on my screen. Oh. Right, screen, so you, yeah. you can see us and the selection at the same time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. that's fine. Okay. I don't know what happened, Eddie. We just saw we saw an icon. There was like it was like a little symbol with a thing through it, like just your camera wasn't uh, available or something. No, I had a job interview a few weeks ago, and the same thing happened, and there was a fifteen minute delay. It's my computer. We've we've had this before, I think, very early on, where maybe like the the camera is associated with Skype or something like that, and then you're trying to use Zoom, and it's already been allocated to Skype mm -hmm. or something like that. Does that make any sense? Skype is the kind of thing no. that will just run in the background no, no. and hoard everything. So. Yeah, and keep it, keep it, in, yeah, exactly. In case in case a video call comes in or something, probably yeah, for Teams or. Are we starting right away now? Yeah. Well, I, th okay. I, I think we've had a long enough break. We're giving this is broadcast break. live. This is broadcast live, yes. This is broadcast. Okay. So well, well, gonna, hope, hopefully we haven't lost our audience from all that first level tech, second level technical support there now that we were that we were failing to provide. The audience, they, they, I sort of, I think they love it when this sort of thing happens. It's, I think they do. Yeah. Uh, well well yeah, done to Rachel Montgomery who had the deduction <laughs> skills to, to guess who which Eddie it was because uh, Eddie Byrne was in chat earlier and isn't normally. Oh. Sleek it, sleek it, sleek it. So, Eddie, are you good then? Yeah, great. You're good. Okay, so Ronan and Eddie, if you're both ready then. Yeah. So, oh. Very best very best of luck to you, lads. And yeah, Ronan. Yeah. Ronan, as our player one, it's your prerogative. Take it away. Your letters, please. Uh, I'll have three vowels and three constants, please. Sure, they are. <clears throat> I, U, and A. <clears throat> H, K, and B. Uh, another vowel, please. E. Uh, a constant, please. R. And a final constant, please. The final, the final L. Thirty seconds. For some reason that's not working there as well. My word. The, the clock's running. It's not the sound isn't for me, but anyway. Oh, okay, we'll just have to hum it. Seven. Hey, and Eddie. And a seven. Yours, please, Ronan. Paulia. 
Hold your hand, hand Eddie. Halberk. Say that again. Halberk. How are you spelling that? H A U B E R K. Halberk. Stephen? Yeah, Halberk is weapon. fine. Yeah, Halberk is fine. It is a piece of armor originally covering only the neck and shoulders, but later consisting of a full length coat of mail on military tunic. Very interesting. Good. Okay. Right, I think because Eddie had shared screen, it knocked off my share. That's what it was. So can I just try that start clock again, Graham? See if... well, well, one moment. Um, okay, I'll reset the clock. Can you can you press your start clock button? Yeah. Yeah, it was. Yeah, that, that's so it. Yeah, it just knocked off then. Okay, that's fine. Right, we'll get around these technicals, yes. So we will. So, right, so seven points apiece. Yeah, what else could they have had? Um, the chat did spot the only eight bulkier. Oh, uh, bulk here. Seems so easy now when you see it, doesn't it? Um, so bulky means awkward or uncooperative. Bulk here. And it's the British spelling. Because we like sticking U's in things. Like the French? Yes, okay, so seven points apiece. Round two. Eddie Byrne, your letters, please. Harry right, Paul. Uh, three consonants and three vowels, please. They are. T... T N E I and A. A consonant R. A consonant T. And um, a consonant, please. And a final D. 30 seconds. And Ronan? Eight. Yours, please, Eddie. Nitrated. Nitrated. Ronan? Uh, same. Uh... This way? Over this way? Oh. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, this way. That's the one. Is it there? Yeah, that's fine. There you go. Yeah, yeah, nitrated. Yes. Yeah. Nitrated is absolutely fine. Well done. Uh, yeah. There were a few other eights available. Mm -hmm. There was atrited, ratinet, and titrated. None of them easy then, really. None of them. None of them leap out at you. No, none of them easy spots. I would be looking for another vowel there at the end or something for, for comfort. But good eights nonetheless. And it's round three, which is Ronan's numbers, please. Four large, please. Four large. Here we go. Your two smalls are quite large. They're eight and ten. Then you have 25, 75, 50, and the 100. And your target... 383, 30 seconds. Three eight three. Yeah, got it. And Eddie. Yes, three eight three. Okay, your way, please, Ronan. Twenty-five times ten. Plus seventy-five plus fifty plus eight. Sorry, twenty-five times ten. Plus seventy-five plus fifty plus eight. All right. Okay, plus seventy-five plus fifty plus eight. Three eight three. Very nice, Eddie. Uh, did fifty times ten. Yeah. Take a hundred, take twenty-five. Three seven five. And add the eight. And add the Ronan, you had me confused there, Ronan, just adding them all up there. That was there. Well after yeah. fifty. Plenty of ways to get there when you just keep that eight, I suppose. Try and get a three seventy five. Yeah. Seven fifty over two for me and then you really get it. So Yeah, it looks like most people went that way. Mm-hmm. Nice, that's like my kind of four large, that one where it's a nice, easy 
25 plus the plus your finishing move. So 25 all it is, and it's round four. Uh, Edward Byrne, your letters, please. Three consonants and three vowels, please, Paul. Sure. L, S, N, E, A, and O. Consonant. C. Consonant. N. And a consonant, please. And final R. Let's zoom down. Well, um, I'll stick with a seven. Okay, Ronan? Yeah, seven as well. Yours, please, Eddie? Cloners. Cloners, yeah. Uh, loners. Cloners and loners. Scanner here. Yep. Yeah. Uh, let's just say there were more sevens available in that round than Belgium scored goals against Armenia. <laughs> <laughs> There are 27s available in that round. They are Ancones, Canners, Canoers, Cloners, Colas, Corse, and Corneal, Corneas, Cornels, and Snarl, Escalar, Lancers, Lanners, Loners, Oracles, Rancels, Recalls, Reloans, Scanner, and Sonans. There you go, stay away. Take a breath. Uh, you've earned it. There you go. Take the night off. Huh? No, don't actually. We need you. But, uh... Well done if you got one of those sevens. It's 32 points apiece. It's round five. That's Ronan's letter, please. Ronan, your letter, please. Uh, I'll have 3,003 3 constants, please. Sure. I, A, and O. E, N, and B. Um, uh, vowel, please. Is an I. A constant, please. T. And I'll finish with a constant, please. Final V. 30 seconds. Seven. Seven, Eddie. I'll try a seven as well. Okay, yours please, Ronan. Obviant. Obviant. And yes, obviant. Obviant, not an obviant spot, Stephen. Um, well, I'm having to search for Lex in Lexco for it because it's not in premium. It's not coming up in Lexco either. The closest I can find is Obviate. Is it in, uh, uh, is it in uh, Apto? Uh, no, it's not in Apto either. Not in Apto either, okay. Mm. Well, lucky, so yeah. Probably just confusing it with Obviate then. Yeah. Yeah. Go on with it myself now. Go on. Yeah, go on, hey, Eddie. You have another no, one? I wouldn't, I wouldn't have gone with that myself. Oh, you wouldn't have. Yeah. 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 Bonita here, La Isla Bonita. Yeah, there was one seven there, uh, Noticia. Uh, oh, yeah. So a noticia is a register or list of ecclesiastical sees or districts. Hard to spot in that order with the eyes so far apart there. That yeah, it's a word I've a word I would get half the time, I suppose, but not in that selection. Okay, well done, anyone who got it. Um, scores remain the same, and it's round six. Round six. Round six. That's Eddie. Your numbers, please. Uh, two large, please, Paul. Two large. Your four smalls are five and ten six and three and your two large are 25 and 75 your target is 929 
Okay. How'd you go on, Eddie? I've got nine thirty not written down. Okay, and Ronan? Yeah, also not written down on thirty. Right, if you just like to take two seconds and write it down, let me know when you're done. Yeah. Okay, Eddie, go for yeah. it. 30. Right, um, 75 plus 3 is 78. Mm -hmm. Times it by 10 is 780. Mm -hmm. and then I did 25 times 6 for 150. And add it on. And add it just. And seven points. And Ronan, how did you get there? Uh, 75 plus 25 minus. Minus five. Ninety-five. Uh, six divided by three for two. Yeah. Take that away and times by ten. Times ten. But nine to nine. Does it add the five, something like that, at the end? Can, is it times six? There was one solution. Adam Latchford got it in chat. Um, he went 75 minus five is 70. Then 10 plus 3 is 13. Mm -hmm. Multiply those together for 9, 10. Okay. Then add the 25 and subtract the 6. 25 minus 6, very good. Well done, Adam. Good score. So, seven points apiece here on that. And... So... Take a very short break, Eddie. How was your How was your day? You were Were you working late or something? What was How come you were only home at that time? No, not working late at all. Just um, joining my mum for dinner. That was all, really. Was she paying? She was. Yeah, good, nice, good, uh, good. Good. Five in Harry. I hope you ordered I, extra. Did you? Uh, yeah. Uh, I don't know. Yeah, whatever. I don't know. I was just getting a haircut after work. Very nice. So yeah, it's just first outing. I had dresses up until eight on a Thursday, and then you rang me, and uh, I was on my way down to get the Thai food. I was having a good one in tonight. Usually, have a festy Thursday, but um, I was bold on my birthday at the weekend. Uh, Duty free vodka I brought back from Braintree got a battering, and I don't remember any of it. Juicy, all oh, right. You get duty free coming back from the UK now, then yeah. Yeah, only ten pounds for a one liter bottle of Morgan's of um, Smirnoff. So. Unfortunately, there's not much left. There's not, no. No. Nope. Healthy, you had healthy mixtures then. Me and four of my friends went to town on it. So how old are you um, now? Uh, 26, 26, as of Monday. 26. Yeah. It's a good age. So officially, yeah. officially, you're not a young person anymore. Apparently, a young person only stretches up to 25 these days. Officially, they say. The age my mum had was when she had me, 26. All right. Um, but uh, no, I'm young and I'll be young till I'm 36. Well, I'm 46 and I'm still young. It's, it's, yeah, it's, it's all in, it's all in here. Yeah. It's all in here. That's what it is. So. That's it. Cool. Well, we would love to chat longer, but we, we, we had we had significant delays yes. earlier on. So we will crack on because I think that would be in most people's interest. Yes, so, I think so. Uh, right. Round seven, then zero point game. It is ruining your letters, please. Uh, yeah. Um... Three vowels, three consonants again, please. Sure. O, E, and I. M, H, and N. Uh, vowel, please. E. Uh, consonant, please. L. And a final consonant, please. Final Y, if that counts. 30 seconds. Just a six. Okay, and Eddie? I will stick with a six in that case. Okay, yours please, Ronan? Homely. Homely, yes, Eddie. Homily. And homily. Yeah, homily. Homily. 
I L Y at the end. I L Y, I think, yeah. The poetic kind of term, I think, is that for yeah. writing literary. It's the homily was with the priest. The priest's yeah. kind of spiel. A holy it? man as well. After the, <laughs> after the gospel, the holy priest would come out. And, well, for, for Catholics in the audience, anyway. For, Woo! Uh, our priest would always like it was this was during the 90s when United really didn't need the help. He would always say a little prayer for Man United. And we're like, this is why they keep winning year after year after year. Uh, emphasized in 94, 95, hopefully. <laughs> I don't remember. I sort of stopped going and it was like, yeah, we used to have a huge <laughs> rows of my mom when I come home from college. And she'd be like, why are you not going to mass? I was like, oh, I, I couldn't find couldn't find the couldn't find the church. And she was like, it's literally right beside the university. Oh, is it? Oh, yeah, I didn't see that. So, one of those, right? So, religious words then, Stephen, anything else in there? Um, chat, a few people in chat did spot sevens. Did they now? Well, they spotted one of the sevens. They had hemline. Ah! Oh. There's also homilin. 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 The homilin is the spotted ray. Do they not, uh, is that Hamlin? Do they not? They're not like a book publisher. No, that, Ham, uh, that's Hamlin. Hamlin. I'm thinking of Hamlin, yeah, sorry. Look, just looks very similar. The spotted ray. Uh, not the ray in our chat. No. Mm-hmm. He's the lesser spotted ray, isn't he? Yes. Well done. Anyone who got one of those sevens? It's round uh, eight now, and that is Eddie or Lesher, please. Uh, three consonants and three vowels, please, Paul. Okay. G, Q, and G. I, A, and I. Consonant. W. Consonant. D. Um, like consonant, please. Final F. <laughs> <laughs> How'd you get on? Four. Four. Big, a big four, Ronan. Four. We've got a big four as well. What's yours, Eddie? Waif. Waif, yes. And uh, Waif. And Waif. Yeah. Correct. Yeah. Ugly selection, Stephen, that one, isn't it? Yeah. Um, even chat could not go further than five. But they got a five. Now, the, there is a five. So Ahmed, Philip, um, Zahib, um, Gordy or something like that. He, no, he it's Agidi. Agidi. Ah. So Agidi is from West African and Caribbean. Mm-hmm. It's a gelatinous starchy food made by boiling a paste of fermented maize meal or flour. Agidi. Okay. Okay. Right, 49 all, it's round nine, and that is Ronan numbers, please. Let's get four large again. Four large. You're two smalls this time. Oh, wait, hang on. Oh, that's a lesson. Go back around. I don't go back around. Back Check one on. round. There we go. Oh, oh, sorry, sorry, Stephen, you did. Yeah, you, you both did it. it. You both pushed the at the same time. Okay. Four large. Four large. Your two smalls are five and seven, and then you have 125, 50, and 75, and your target seven, nine, eight, 30 seconds. So, 798 then. Yeah, go 798. Okay, and Eddie? 798, not written down. Okay, we'll go for you then. Uh, 7 add 5 is 12. Yeah. Times by your 75 for 900. Mm-hmm. Take to 100. 800. 
And then you have 50 over 25 for your two to take off, and that makes 798. Done, 798. Same way, Ronan? Yeah, same way. All these four large methods of getting there. Stephen? Yep, that looks like how chat did it as well. Mm -hmm. Okay, well done, guys. We will play hard to separate these two. So, 59 all. Round 10. Eddie, your letters, please. Uh, three consonants and three vowels, please, Paul. Sure. W, D, and S, I, O, and O. A consonant, please. M. A consonant, please. G. And a consonant, please. And a final C. Seven. Seven. Ronan? I think I've got a seven. Yours, please, Eddie. Cosmoid. Cosmoid, yes. Ronan? I think I'm making it up. Sodomic. Sodomic. Yeah. <laughs> well, we know the stem. Stephen? Now, I mean, the um, major surprise is that Eddie didn't get that. Is it, um, is it valid? Uh, sodomic is valid, and it means exactly what you think it means. Okay. We'll and it's cosmoid valid. We'll uh, cosmoid is not valid. I'll give you one of those for that. Plus me to miss an ice swear. Sodomic is the only seven. Sodomic is the only seven. Okay, so <laughs> yours wasn't in, Eddie, then, no. <laughs> oh, what was yours, <laughs> Cosmoid? Yeah, yeah and I was, thinking of the word, I was thinking of the word Sigmoid because it rhymes with and it's a little bit related. Yeah, I thought there would be an oid in there for some description. <laughs> but no. so, oh, so. well. Sodomic. Okay. Make whatever references you want about that privately. We'll not do them on air. Okay. It's set 66 <laughs> to 59. <laughs> Round 11 is Ronan, your letters, please. Uh, send again three vowels, three constants, please. Sure. A, E, and A. F, G, and S. Uh, constant, please. T. Uh, vowel, please. E. And a final constant, please. And a final R. That's soon done. Seven. Seven, Eddie. And also a seven. Okay, yours please, Ronan. Feaster. Feaster, Eddie. Restage. Restage. Yep, nothing wrong with either of those. Was there anything longer? Uh, no. Seven was the max. The other sevens available were air eights, a freets, a graphs, and surfage. Looking to see Paul Nixon probably maxing all these now. He loves these flat selections, is that right, Paul? <laughs> Too many vowels there for me, Paul. Too many vowels. Yeah, that one. Yeah, I was thinking the more of the previous one was on there. Oh yeah, I like I like Eddie's previous. Yeah, one. They, okay. Lots of consonants here. Right. So seventy three sixty six. It's round twelve now. That is your final letters, Eddie. Uh, three consonants. N, S, and D. And three vowels. E, A, and E. Consonant. D. Consonant. R. And a consonant, please. And final L.
Edward. Uh, nine. Ronan. Nine. Yours, please, Eddie. Slandered. Slandered. Ronan. Slandered. Slandered. <clears throat> yeah. Well, at least we know how you know that one. I'm not sure about the last S word, but we probably learned that off Eddie. But slandered, Stephen. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah. Slandered was the nine. Wow. We get a round of applause for the for a double, a double zoom down nine. Yeah. I think if you get one, if you get a nine on on the sh on the TV show that you've already got on zoom down, you should you should be. Jumper over the head with a zoom down T-shirt and a power slide in front of Anne. That's what you, that's what you should be doing. So glad to get a nine after all these attritional selections. Yeah. Nice. So, <laughs> nice. Yeah, there weren't any in the previous four games. No. Ninety-one to eighty-four. It's round thirteen, which is Ronan. Final letters, please. Uh, vowel, please. Just the one. Okay, it's O. Two consonants. R D. Two vowels. U and E. Constant, please. P. Uh, vowel. E. Uh, another vowel, please. Another E. And a final constant, please. And a final S. 30 seconds. Beatbox the clock again, am I? Five seconds. Yeah. Um, Time. Who's uh, the seven? Uh, Eddie? Seven. Uh, Ronan, what's yours? Uh, reposed. And Eddie? Also reposed. Yeah. Yeah. Seven or one. Yeah, reposed is fine for seven. Uh, seven was indeed the max. Could also have had perused, uh, poderies, pure D, and speeder. Apparently, I am the host now. Yeah, Paul had to go off and come back on again, but he's, no, he's back now. You muted, Paul. Yeah, I'm on to a network engineer in the morning for some to find out why this is happening. So hopefully, I'll get an answer before Tuesday. So yeah, that round was uh, that round, yeah. yeah, it was it was seven seven. Seven. What were the words? Reposed and reposed. Reposed and reposed. Okay, nothing longer, Stephen. No. Uh, no, just perused, poderies, pure D, and speeder. Okay, cool. So scores ninety eight to ninety one as we go into round fourteen. It's anyone's game. Eddie, your final numbers, please. Uh, one large, please, Sato. One large. Here we go. Your five smalls are eight, six, and one, nine, and three, and your large is a 50. Your target, eight, three, five. 30 seconds. Of course, we don't have the music this time. All right. Do, 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 do. Three five, Eddie. Yes, eight three five. And Ronan. Also eight three five. Go for it, Eddie. Uh, so I did fifty take one. Forty nine. Uh, nine plus eight is seventeen. Seventeen, yeah. Times those together. Break three three. Mm -hmm. And then I did six over three for the two, and I added that on. Six over three was two. Ronan. Same you went the same way, way did you? Yeah. Oh, I just used the 17 to get to 850 and then 6 minus 1 for the 5 times 3 for the 15 then to take it off. Oh. Stephen? Yeah, uh, looks like chat have done some variation of those. No LNAFP available? You can get uh, those. No, there are only five solutions in the first place. Oh, okay. Apparently Bradley guessed 836 and 837 for the numbers game. Unlucky. Should have bought more tickets. 
Okay, so what are we now? 108 to 101 as we're heading for the crucial zoom down conundrum. So if you're very both ready, guys, fingers on your buzzers, yes? Yeah. I think, uh, can we, can we, check, can we check, can we check your buzzers? Um, yeah. Okay. Okay. Uh, uh, Eddie, can you press your buzzer? Okay, great. Yeah. And uh, Rona, can you press yours? Okay, that all works fine. Perfect. Right, so the very best of luck to you guys. Very, very best Good of luck. luck. Good luck. We reveal today's crucial zoom down conundrum. Ronan. Uh, no, sorry. Rest of the time to Eddie. Tagmaster. Tagmaster. Not. Oh. Uh, Not. So. Uh, we're throwing it up to the chat. We only have 2.7 seconds gone, and we've had two incorrect answers, Graham. So we'll throw it over to anyone in the chat here. Anyone here, first of all. Anyone in the room? Paul? Hazel's got it. Hazel? Uh, stratagem. Oh, bollocks! Sorry. Well done, Hazel. Well done. Well done. Thank you. Sorry, that's my course language. Sorry. Right, right. <laughs> We've that. had worse on the show. Yeah. Uh, I just... Hard luck, Eddie. Hard luck. Yeah, Ronan, that was, did you even mark. read it, Ronan, by the time you buzzed? I didn't know it was like... Yeah, I was very panicked. Wouldn't have got it anyway, so... Your buzz was 0.7 seconds, Ronan. That's, that, but that's like slow for his for, on Apto, isn't it, really? That's just, that's average. Uh, I'd have got, uh, I've got no, as a nine before. Strat it's a hard one, it is. It's not an easy spot, now, stratagem. It's, um, there's so, there's so many dead ends and things that you can, you can go down, so... Yeah. Did they get it in chat, Stephen? Were there... uh, yeah, a couple of people got it in chat. Were there uh, any yeah, valids um, as well? Um, no, anyone who guessed, yes, stratagem. Very good. They're all clever, clever bunch, aren't they? So, so what an interesting night. It's been full of technicals and tetra champs, and it's everything. We've had a little bit of everything. <laughs> Just got to have a breather now for a few days. You have, so are we, so we can try and fix some technical stuff and all that and see if we can get some more systems in place, Graham, maybe to yeah, yeah. avoid these kind of things. Easier said than done, but it's not, it's just, if you can't connect to a Zoom call, you can't connect to a Zoom call. You don't know how these things are going to work, so. Well, normally we um, have people join at half past seven to, to fix those problems. Yeah. But we couldn't have that today for various reasons. No, it was, uh, we had, like, there was, there was a player who, who was uh, meant to be on in Eddie's place, but then there was, there was an emergency came up. So we had to, Eddie stepped in at the last minute. So thank you very much for that, Eddie. Very much, very much appreciated. Uh, at least I can go on the session next Tuesday and Thursday. There you can, yeah. But take your phone with you, watch Zoom down, and tell everyone else to watch as well, and just stick it on the big screen or something. That's what you need to do. So yeah, what? My you story is in on the big screen. You normally go out. You normally go out midweek, do you? Then God, it's been a while. I normally go out on a Thursday night. Oh, yeah, uh, there's a touch screen quiz on Max Doilies. Oh, that's not very COVID friendly, is it? A touch screen quiz. Uh, on your phone, like you know, like oh, right, uh, okay. I thought you meant there was like a giant, yeah. a giant panel, and everyone had to use the same one or something. <laughs> well, I don't know. It might be a super spreader <laughs> club. Probably it is. In general. Yeah, you can just catch everything that there's ever been. <laughs> Herpes and <laughs> all the different gonorrhea. Things. Yeah, or everything, everything, anything. Syphilis. Popular twentieth century diseases. I'm sure you would get them. So very right. sodomic. Well, anyway, guys, thanks, thanks for everything tonight. Much, much appreciated. It's been, it's been a yeah, a stoppy, starty kind of night. So I'm glad we're finished. It's a reasonable hour. I mean, this we used to think this was early, Graham. You know, even this was, this was us a couple of seasons ago. This was everything had gone swimmingly, and we were really glad to be finished by before ten bells. We've just got quicker at it, so we're maybe we're, our standards are a little higher. <laughs> nowadays, a, a, a quick, a quick episode it finishes at half past nine. And at then half a, nine. A, yeah. a normal episode finishes nine thirty-five, nine forty, and then yeah. sometimes if if a lot of things have gone wrong, we end well nine forty-nine. It's about here. Yeah, it is. Mind that car thrown in there. It's not too nothing to worry about, is it? No, no. Good, 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 good. Not it's that we can catch late. anything here. We're not, you know, we're not, we're not under any threat, David. I don't know. There's, there's a new variant. Maybe it can spread over Zoom now. The Zoom variant, yeah, that would be. Oh well, yeah. Be interesting one. Right, guys, I'm gonna let you all go because so, I need some fresh air. It's absolutely boiling in here. So thank you very much tonight, uh, Ronan. We will let you know who you play very shortly. 
um, right. because that's pretty much all arranged. So you won't have yeah. you won't have long to wait. We will let you know. All right. Well, then. congratulations again. We'll see, see you in the final. Thank you. Tuesday. Thank you. Hazel Bye. and Eddie, thank you very, very much for taking part. Good to see you again. Bye, Paul. Thank uh, you. Congratulations, Ronald. Thank you, Ed. And Good we'll say, well have thank a good you. weekend, everyone. Thanks for Bye, watching. Everyone. Don't forget to subscribe, and we'll see you all on Tuesday. Good night, Tim. Hey, good night.